Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to the channel. And you know that's Dibs Nails for x World with the family. Okay. Oh, Lord. This is just a hot train wreck of a mess again. It is, people. It is. I mean, I'm sitting here looking like Skip to the Duluth, my darling. What the hell is Todd doing? What is he doing? What is he doing, Candy? I told you you can't leave him alone for too long because he's going to start copying people's ideas. Um, the food truck? What about the restaurants? blaze as well as olg aren't you supposed to get them in working order and beating the inspectors when they come by girl what is he don't went to somebody old junkyard or something and i pulled this uh fixture of a thing on wheels was that not brian's idea was that not brian's idea what are y'all doing what is todd going around here stealing folks ideas for now I know he clinched the deal. He he put the deal together with Brian, and uh, it was between him and Brian. But Brian wanted y'all to invest in his truck, cause he the one came up with a truck, a food truck. Okay. Now I ain't gonna let y'all get away with this. Now this is some bullshit. This is some bullshit. Okay. In case Brian can't speak out for himself, I'm gonna tell him for you. Okay. That's some bullshit. You cannot sit there and dog this brother out in public with his own idea. You slapping him in the face. You couldn't give him a full contract where y'all gave him a mobile unit because that's what he wanted to do. You do have the funds to invest in his project. But how is Todd going to go around and take Brian's idea? He liked the egg roll, so I don't know if he sold 50% of it and he kept the other percent in his company, which was bullshit. That's one of them uh, wrong contracts that those new artists be signed with the music industry. Oh, Lord. I said, when I saw this, I said, this is some bullshit. So everybody go over there and show Todd some love uh, on Todd167 and ask him the question. Uh, what happened to Brian? You and Brian going to share that mobile thing? Both of y'all going to be... Uh, Running around in these streets in Atlanta trying to sell some egg rolls or whatever. Because I'm like, okay, so are the restaurants closing? And y'all just going to have the mobile unit? What's going on? Tell us the tea can. Why are you out here fussing with Marlo and talking about what you do for the community? And she had your ass all out of character. I was like, oh, Lord, here we go again. Don't you, don't you cry, Candy. Don't you cry. But that's for another video I'll be putting out later. <laughs> Child, but I just I had to come through. I had to swing through. I said, what is Todd doing? What is Todd doing again? Starting businesses and not completing them. Doing renovation and not completing them. Oh, what 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 you going to do with him, Candy Girl? That's your man. That's your man, girl. But God damn. Is, is he just messing up all his money? Then when he mess up his money, he come for your money. Is that what we got going? Or the money that child made together, he's investing in, in projects such as this. I mean, really? I mean, it's Todd. Are you going to be running these wheels? This uh, restaurant on wheels? Because uh, you didn't know what you were doing in the kitchen at the OLG gang. And now you want us to trust you. You can't even get the inspections right at the OLG in Blaze uh, Steak Blazing Steakhouse over there, and you. Th I think they do special uh, health inspections on these mobile units that's selling food to the public. Okay, the consumer of your goods. We don't want to get sick, man. We don't want to get sick. Uh, y'all need to do better. Y'all need to do better, especially on Brian. Why y'all do that boy like that? 
Why you think? I think you need to apologize to Brian Candy on behalf of your husband, and y'all get that boy a truck. Cause you know that's just blatant stealing around here. And if Brian really wanted to take you out of court, I think he would have a very good case. Cause the only thing he had to do is pull up the first season of the OLG Candy and the Gang, Gang, Gang. Yes, honey. See why I can't get Candy too much. She be letting Todd do too much shit around him. I'm like here we go again. Here we go again. In my eyes, the brother's voice. Oh, here we go again. I thought our love was over, but here we go again. That's why I can't get with you and talk 100%. It's like I'm 87% with y'all, 87%. And y'all keep doing this slick shit on Brian. You know that was his dream. I hope he ain't somewhere drinking. I hope he ain't sitting there drinking and drinking all his words away. Like, can't stop playing. Stop playing with people's emotions now. Stop playing with people's lives. All right? Now, you know you ain't paying Brian that good at the OLG. You, you ain't. I, I can just tell you because y'all was so quick to say, oh, uh, we pay what the government says to pay. It's 725 And you think that's, girl, y'all think that's the way of living that a person who really need to feed their family or the, a single mom or dad just struggling. It's just themselves trying to make it work. Trying to make ends meet. No. Y'all should have everybody at 12 to $13 an hour at the restaurants. The servers. The bus boys. Cooks need to make a little bit more. Because they be in that hot damn kitchen trying to make it up. Make the food go and make it do what it do. Okay. They need a little bit more. But the host. All of them need at least $12 an hour. Okay. Because y'all are doing some foolish ass shit. I can't believe I saw Todd up. That's, that, see here we go again. Candy. He's spending up the money that y'all making together. And probably wanting you to invest again as well. I don't understand. I'm like, Todd ain't going to be, he is not going to be riding around. And he's not going to keep it sanitary. Oh, it's another bad idea. Another bad idea. Okay, look at the red flags. I know you've seen them. Look at the red flags. Don't let that man boss you over there and make you feel guilty. Because we already got to get on your ass by letting Marlo get you out of character. I'm like, good God, Candy. Stop trying to cry all the time. You couldn't be on my team. You couldn't be on my team. We don't show fear. We don't show fear. We don't show upsetness. We just get a go straight. You know what I'm saying? And we be looking red. Our eyes be probably looking red and everything. And we be focused right on that person. So they don't know we talking about them. We ain't looking everywhere else. You know how they say you be lying. You be looking everywhere else. But, but at the person. Nah, we, we staring you dead in the eye. Can't try to say. What the hell are you going on? Every time you get mad, you got to cry. No, nah, you can't be on our team. You can't come. Mm -mm, we show no fear. We do not cry. And we get shits done. We get sh we shut shits down, okay? Is what we do. And we ain't even got to put our hands on you. I mean, Mar Marlo read you for filth. Oh, I'm like, girl, you don't know nobody in the gay section that can tell you how to read, girl. You all, Every time I see you and somebody get confrontational with you, you already crying this year. Ain't, ain't nobody got time for that crying. You too damn old to be trying to cry. You need to seek therapy for that, Ken. You need to see some serious therapy for that. Because we, we, when we have to go in for battle, when we have to go do work on folks, okay, that we can keep out the eyes of the law. We don't need you over there slapping somebody, slitting, hemming them up, and you crying at the same damn time. No, nah, you're going to make everybody just say, no, nah, we sorry. We, you know, we, we, we didn't mean to get in there. Because we sit up there looking at you, you know, putting somebody, checking somebody, you crying, trying to tell them, I told you not to mess with me. <laughs> Why are you talking bad about me? <laughs> yeah, no, nah, we ain't got no time for that, can. Uh-uh. Nope. No way, no how, no God. Okay, get it together, girl. Get it together. But I need y'all to do better. I need y'all to do better. Y'all need to go up there and, and, and right or wrong because Brian asked y'all for a truck. I know he did because he said it on, on the show. I was over there watching here and there, here and there. But, uh, yeah, it didn't transpire. He just made a, a, a deal that he would cover his rolls in the, uh, what do you call them, soul food rolls. Egg rolls in his restaurant. I don't know if it's Baby Blaze or if it's um, OLG. It doesn't matter at this time. But what matters is, Todd, you know, stole another idea from somebody else. Now, can then we go through this with you, with one of your employees that was mad at you because you didn't pay them overtime. You didn't pay them the correct money. And he had to take you. He, actually, I think he used Phaedra. But Phaedra just did a little bit of it. And she tossed it over to somebody else. She knows she didn't know what the hell she was doing. She didn't want to lose another one. She'd been messing around. Losing for Bobby Brown every time he turned around. Then he, um, she lost for Sheree. <laughs> Woo! And that when the whole lingo came. When a case came about. When a case. Because Phaedra wasn't closing no deals. With winning no cases for any black 
entrepreneurs around here okay so i'm like okay uh what if brian come up there and tell y'all y'all stole my idea i want y'all to make it right what would y'all say well definitely you would have to say yes we did but knowing you and and, and todd can you said uh -uh, we've been tossing that idea around we've been doing it no 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 hell to the no 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 Get it together, Candy, because you're looking kind of stupid out here, I'm telling you. And the only reason why you're looking stupid out here is because you got that flipper head right there. I'm going to have to call him flipper head, too. That little boy right there, because that's what he act like, a little boy. And he had the nerve to speak on Marlo when, I don't know what they were doing. I don't know if Candy was interviewing him or he was interviewing Candy. I don't know how it went, but I know I saw something. And I think it was Candy on speak on it. She was saying something to the fact of, how do you think... How do you feel about Marlo getting a peach? I'm like, damn, why are you asking him that question? He don't have no authority to hire or fire. This same candy and the gang, 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 gang. That, well, we ain't on that. We on the real Hawaii's of Atlanta. And Todd has no pool, no pool at all. So his really uh, response was not even needed. Not at all. But I know you're trying to be, you know, kind of. Uh, salty because you and her had got into it and you now one time i said look well let me look at this situation from another perspective okay because i do that at times before i make my solid opinion on how i feel i said could they be doing this for a publicity stunt are they really trying to like make us think they have a beef and it's going to make us uh come more uh to each episode until it probably airs the episode that can't have previously talked about before the show had came into fruition for season 14 i, I, I just say it keeps uh lingering at me that that's what they're doing they're not really mad at each other or, or whatever they just trying to tr you know uh create some chaos to keep us running back on sundays to look at this show but no 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 all that we have to do if it's like a click in a view once we click on it that you get that view or somebody viewed the, the show entirety i guess i don't know but if, if it ain't showing that i ain't for to look at it can i'm not i'm not gonna do it. i'm not gonna do it girl i'm not gonna do it can't make me do it i'm not gonna do it can't make me do it because you know i can't 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 can can all right but yeah that's all i have for this video i was my i was hot man and I know Brian must be stewing. His head probably don't popped off his body right about now. If he saw this mess with Todd did. I'm like, how big of a slap in the face can you stand? Ah, uh, from your employee. I couldn't work for them no more, Brian. You might need, you know. I don't know. I don't know. Because you might be staying there. Because maybe they'll get a second season of Candy and the gang, gang, gang. You know what I'm saying? You might want that notoriety to keep promoting your business. But when you use a can in Todd's platform and can, I mean, uh, Todd is running the show, shit ain't going to act right. It's going to fall apart every single time. It's going to be an issue. So, it's kind of like, I don't know, you might have made a, a deal with the devil. Because if he, cause I think if I'm not understanding, and family, get me correct, when they had talked about the deal before Candy and the gang show was finna in its season, did he say Todd wanted 50% of his business? And that's that's kind of bad because he should have only asked for 20%. Just in case the company was going to go belly up. You know, he wouldn't have lost that much. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, I got a problem with that, can I have a major problem with you screwing over people or your husband screwing over people and you co-signing for it. So, I think y'all need to make that right. Make that right with Brian and, and publicize it so I can definitely see that, you know, you, you a woman of honor and, and, and you don't like running over people. But right, the the the, uh, the optics that I'm getting right about now, don't say that, can Don't say that. It's like you're trying to get off on uh, Brian. So I'm like, well, I gave you an opportunity. No, you ain't getting no opportunity. You were calling your own pockets. And you just added people on that you thought would be good for the show. So let's keep it real. Let's keep it a buck. How y'all see it? Let's keep it a buck. But anyway, guys, that's all I had for this uh, particular video. Make sure you subscribe, share, like my videos, okay? Go over to the other channel because, you know, I'm going to be cutting up over there. Make it make sense. Do the same thing there. Share, like and comment over there and subscribe if you haven't done so and then you know we have a third channel that i share with my daughter uh shit i don't know what it's called <laughs> i think it's you and me together us two or something like show what's the name of our show show what's the name of our show yeah you and me just us two the two is the letter i mean the out women uh the number two you and me, just us two. Okay? And I might have to get her to tag 
tag it or show me again how uh tag it in my community uh thing and how you know you got it right if you trying to look for our show together it's two avatars the avatar that looks like me uh and the avatar that looks like her okay so that's all i really got for this video guys like it love we gotta have more you know i love y'all y'all take care and i'll see y'all next video okay because you know i can't can and i can't can i can't can i can't can and i will bye bye